Uh, Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem, Akadash. Shalom to the uh, elders, Waaki and Waakwa. And I say Shalom. And this is a uh, sit down lesson of uh, First Maccabees chapter three and verse forty eight. And this is a uh, title of the sit down lesson. And it reads from the uh, apocryphal books of the Holy Scriptures of uh, First Maccabees chapter three and verse forty eight. And reads. And laid open the book of the law, by the Holy Scriptures, KGV, sixteen eleven, and the apocryphal books. And laid open the book of the law, whether the heathen, which is the other nations, had sought to paint the likeness of their image, right? That false image of uh, Caesarea Borgia, and this uh, modern day Babylonian system. Right along with this uh, modern day Babylonian economical system, because you look up the word Babylon, it goes into uh, the law, which is confusion, you know. Because Job 9 and 24, the earth is given to the hands of the wicked, a couple of faces of the judge of their world, which is the Israelites. And the ultimate judge, which is the creator, this is uh, the heavenly father, uh, Yahweh of Israel. But the scripture says, uh, I believe it's in uh, Exodus. If I'm not mistaken, but roughly paraphrased, the scripture says, you know, we're not supposed to have no graven images of the Heavenly Father, you know. So that's why you have this ultimate deceiver is painting, painting the likeness of their image, the false images, thinking that they are the most high. So, you know, it's a recompense that's coming for that. So the Heavenly Father doesn't like that, you know. That's why you ain't supposed to have no graven images, you know. That's what the wicked is. The wicked is being ruled right now. So they paint the pit, the picture of likeness of their images, thinking that they are the most high, thinking that they are the chosen people of the most high, thinking that they are uh, the most high, thinking they are higher than the most high, which is kind of crazy, you know kind of crazy, boastful, prideful, and arrogant, you know, so the Heavenly Father's not dealing with nobody as boastful, prideful, and arrogant, and trying to act like that they are the Most High, like they are made in the image of the Most High, you know, Yahweh of Israel, so that makes totally a lot of sense, as I was, you know, doing the sit-down lesson of First Maccabees 3 and 48, and I'm going to read again, then I'm going to bring out the book of Job, uh, chapter 9, verse 24. This is uh, 1 Maccabees chapter 3, verse 48. And they open the book of the law, write the Holy Scriptures, where the heathen, which is the other nations, has sought to paint the likeness of their image. Write that B-E-A-S-T image of Sejua Borgir. That's that uh, B-E-A-S-T image in this modern-day Babylonian sy uh, system. Because the earth is given into the hands of the wicked, cover the faces of the judge that were uh, Proverbs 29, verse 2. When the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice, but when the wicked bear rule, the people mourn. You know, that false image of such rewards here. The customs of their ways, thinking that they are the most high, thinking that they are made in the image of the most high, you know. So the Heavenly Father is not dealing with nothing like that, you know. So that's definitely not right. And it doesn't make any sense either as well, too. And this is uh, Job Salakia. Job, our great forefather Job. This is a the book of Job, chapter nine and verse twenty-four. The earth is given into the hands of the wicked, and he covered the faces of the just thereof. If not, where and who is he? Right. If not, where and who is he? Hey, because the wicked is bare rule right now. Proverbs chapter twenty-nine. It's the book of Proverbs, chapter 29, and verse 2. Yep, it's the book of Proverbs, chapter 29, and verse 2. It says, when the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice, but when the wicked bear rule, the people mourn. 
So when the righteous are the authority, the people rejoice. But when the wicked man rule, the people mourn. That false image of Sajjari Borgia and the wicked is bare rule right now. That's why it's a uh, second Ezra 6 and verse 9, prime example. And let's go back into the Maccabees. Then I'm going uh, to close it out from there. And this is uh, 1st Maccabees chapter 3 verse 48 Read it again for edification's sake of this uh, sit down lesson and This is 1st uh, Maccabees 3 verse 48 From the uh, Apocrypha books of the Holy Scriptures and reads And lay open the book of the law Wherein the heathen had sought to paint the image of it To sought to paint the likeness of their image So with that hopefully this uh, sit down lesson is uh, edifying of this uh, uh, sit down lesson of our uh, first Maccabees 3 verse 48 and that was the title of the sit down lesson so both of these lessons are fine and with that I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Ba'ashem Yahweh Shai Ba'ashem Akakadash Shalom to the uh, elders Wa'aki and Wa'akwa and until next time I will say Shalom